I should mention the fact that, um, you know, we've had past partnerships with these people and they've done exactly what they said they were going to do initially when they, they built the new facility in that auto mall. It was a sales tax sharing agreement and that was completely extinguished. So we've had a long track record of success with these people and we'd recommend that it be continued. No more questions for Mr. Lawson. Any other questions? Thank you, Mr. Lawson. Thank you very much. Uh, Okay, we have one speaker card, David Paul. Mr. Mayor, Vice Mayor and Council, good evening. I stand before you in support of RNB1. If you don't understand that you have to protect the economic tax base of our city, then I don't know what you do understand. Um, but I'm a little confused. There's, there's. Um, a lot of accusations flying around. I took this off one of the blogs. It's AV Town Crier. He says, I think Pope Rex did this on purpose, the religious controversy. While we're all focusing on the religious BS, Rex and his cronies are looting City Hall. I remember the great press conference Mr. Pelka held on the street when he dropped out of the mayor race and said that He's going to be shining the light on corruption and watch the cockroaches scatter. And in here, Mr. Rodeo says, shine the light on public business so there's no backroom deals. Is this a backroom deal? I'm not sure. But if they have any proof that that stuff goes on, I wish they'd bring it forward. That's all I have to say. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Paul. No more speakers' cards. OK. 